What's up guys, it's Chris from Brothers Outdoors. Out here this morning, about to do a little prep, uh, getting ready for velvet buck season. So we gonna go check on our deer stands, make sure everything's ready to go. So I'm here with the fellas and we all gonna get it going today. It's time to go check on these deer stands and get ready to hunt. So special August edition of Brothers Outdoors in the woods for deer. So let's get it y'all, let's have a good one. Now he just set off that just so we can kill some bugs in there. Some wasps got in and other unwanted critters. So we uh doing a little defuminization de de is what it is. So that's what we got going with this. So getting this deer stand together. And guys, this is kind of what I do. I like to get out the four wheel and I like to walk. I like to walk the woods and I like to scout things out. Put it right here. Yeah. And uh get it going.
something in there. What? There's some kind of animal I just saw. An animal? Yeah. What do you do? I think it's some kind of bird, y'all. Open the door. I did. Hold on, bro. Gotta make sure that back door open. It's open. I think y'all just scaring it. Go. 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 Did something run or what? Yeah, it ran. It's one white. I think it's a chicken. A chicken? Yeah, it's definitely a chicken, dude. It's, it's bird poop all in there. There's a chicken inside there. Open the door, let him out. No, y'all ain't, ain't worried about no chicken. It is a chicken. It's See multiple. It? No, it's uh, Ronnie, right those are vultures. Vultures? Those are vultures, y'all. The baby vultures. Wow. That ain't no chicken. You got to be kidding me. Baby vultures? How many of them in there? Two. They may not be baby though. They look kind of old. It look like they've been growing in there for a while. And they got through that open window. So and there's poop all in there. We're going to have to bring some spray and all kind of stuff. Well, guys. Vultures have gotten into one of the deer stands and it looks disgusting. Did you got a good picture of them? Let me see if I can show the guys the, the video. That's the inside of the deer stand. And they hung up over there in that corner. Yep. Yep, there they go. This. You ever been inside a chicken coop, Dad? Uh, not my long time, I think. Well, that's what it looked like in there. Huh? Doing when I bang on it. Just in the corner, they scared. Do I need to get busy with this? But they got babies. They they appear to be babies. They still got their white feather on. But mama's gotta be around here watching somewhere. Alright, bro. Just pop the door where the door stay wide open. Well, it's open. They can get out right there. Yeah, they can get out like they like this. They're pretty wide open. Duct tape on the other side of the drum swing it over. Alright, run it past that duct tape. This I did offer to go in there and get busy. That's on the other side. I'm gonna swing the door that way. Uh, okay. Right. Hold that for Let's me. put a piece of tape on the side. All right. So, the deer stand has been invaded by vultures. We just taped it open, leaving the door propped open so they can come out. But look at that, y'all. It's the most disgusting thing you've ever seen in your life. That's all vulture poop. And then you got the baby vultures over there in the corner. Yep. Yeah. So yeah, it's pretty nasty out here. What you think, Billy? I mean, I can go get them out. I know, but <laughs> we gonna do the we gonna do the conservation thing. Billy will get them out. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. Billy will get them out. But the thing is, if we, we but the thing is, out. if we get them out, we gonna have to get the poop out. We're going to have to get a lot of and stuff let out. let me remind so. you that those birds are protected by federal law. Yeah. Yeah, that is true, so. <laughs> You got to let them fly out of there. Yeah, <laughs> and that's the thing, so. Shoo, look, shoo, fly bird. Shoo, shoo, shoo. I thought they were chickens. The turkey boat. When I saw their white. I thought they were chickens, too. When I saw the white uh, fur, I thought it was a chicken as well, but. <laughs> definitely baby vultures, so. We're going to let Mama come get them. We left the door propped open so they'll be able Mama to get out. I'm looking at so, somewhere right now, I guarantee you. So we're going to have to do something to clean this stand out. So I may need to well, figure out what we're going to do about door, it. I'm a raccoon something going there and get them. Yeah, that door propped now, so we good at the road. All right.
today. Got a couple of uh, blinds out. Checked on some fans. Saw a couple of bolsters. Saw a bunch of poop. A bunch of spiders. A bunch of poison oak. But I love it, man. This is why we deer hunt. Yep. So this is why you got to prepare because you never know what you're going to run into out here. So if we would have came out here getting ready to hunt and ran into all this stuff, it would have been a nightmare. So I'm glad it all worked out. So that's right. That's how you do it. That's right. All right, guys, so that's a wrap for the day. We got a lot accomplished. Had a lot of fun. Good to be out here again with my brothers and dad. Special edition here in August. We're usually not doing this to September, October. So it's good to be out here early in the year preparing to hunt. You know, we as hunters, we want to make sure that everything goes smoothly when we out hunting. So this is how you do so. And that's in your preparation. So all in all, good day. Next time, hopefully we'll have a buck down. All right, catch y'all later. Brothers Outdoors out. Peace. Peace. Peace.